Hello folks and welcome to Best Choice Trailers and RVs located at 1449 Arona Road in Irwin, PA. Telephone number is 724-864-1449. Today we're looking at a 2024 Micro Light by Flagstaff. The model number is a 25BRDS, that's the bunk model. And we're going to go over some of the great features on this unit today. So starting up front we have a one piece painted cap with an auto style glass shield. We have a night light out here, so that nighttime you can see the path coming towards your camper to campground. Coming down the side of the camper, we've got the power legs, the power stabilizer jacks, and they are stabilizer jacks. These are PS2s that comes with two motors. It's not a single system by Lippert, it's a double motor drive system, so it gives you more power and gives you a better stance over time. Note the large opening here for storage as well as the slam latch doors and magnetic holders. It comes with an inline water filtration system, which you can replace these easily over the internet. As we go down the side of the camper, we've got the screen door, large opening to get inside, and they have a screenshot here, and what that screenshot does, that's what this device is here, it actually closes the door behind you once you release it. So if your hands are full, something like that, it's a nice feature to have so you're not trying to fight to get the door closed. Here we have the step above steps. So everybody likes the solid steps nowadays, but then again, this is a premium brand. They go a little bit above grade on these. They actually put a hydraulic piston on this, so it gives it a zero gravity feel. So these steps can be brought down simply by bringing them down by one hand. And then once you get to center, they're basically zero gravity. They don't weigh anything. These things won't come out and hit you in the head. You actually have to pull them down to get them down. It's a nice feature on this unit. Comes with a large grab handle, six gallon hot water, uh, electric and gas hot water tank, excuse me. Uh, large outside metal table for you to do your work on your Blackstone style grill with your Forest River flipper that comes with it from Forest River. Um, it also has the rear power stabilizer jacks. Again, it's a dual motor drive PS2 system. They give you the bracket outside if you want to bring your TV from inside to outside. It actually just lifts up and holds on the, this location here. And you have your 110 and your cable outlet here as well. The second half of the outdoor kitchen area is a dual stop cooktop burner as well as a 110 refrigerator. Note the large awning on the outside complete with the LED lights and you have the sound you can see up there and moving around the back of the camper we've got LED lights all the way around so it's got LED lights on both sides front and back it's uh, up to date per se a lot of the older campers still use those 60s lenses not with this company here the lap back ladder is always standard on any type of Flagstaff product it's because the walk-on roof is uh, is very nice feature on this unit um, the back door storage area goes into the bunk area as we can see we have the single bunk here and large storage below But this actually lifts up and folds flat Let me get it up there so you can see it And it lifts up and locks in so you can put storage in kayaks will fit things of that nature in the back area Below this door we have a 250 pound max weight uh, hitch. It's already welded to the frame we have a spare tire, which is standard. And as we come around the non-door side, we've got our area where we have the 30 amp plug-in 110, as well as the area where you hook up your water, your black tank flush, and fill your tank right here. Located right below that is your gray and your sewer connections, which are located here. And everything's right in one sector area. So it's a real nice area. We have additional storage uh, right here below the dinette, which you can see is there. And we have additional storage here as well on the side. Note this unit comes with a slide topper over the slide. That's an option. We put them on all of the ones that come the best choice. This is the other side of the storage. So you have both doors, magnetic holders. So let's go over some features inside, shall we? forward area we have the um, couch that has the lazy boy features on both sides and these ends come up and go down and then 
then it also folds flat, comes out there, and your Murphy bed just comes down. It's on, again, hydraulics. So it takes some of the weight off of it, and this just comes down and locks into place so it doesn't move. This is a 60 by 80 bed. It's a memory foam with a gel top. These are very comfortable. They sell these in stores actually. So it's not so much an RV mattress, but it's a real mattress for you to use. A quick release to put it back up. It locks into place here. We've got large storage and you can see how deep those are on both sides, as well as the drawers. Note the finish on all the drawers, European style hinges, solid uh, doors as well. And then this unit will feature an 1800 watt inverter. So with the single panel that comes standard to 200 watt panel, we actually order the second one optional. So it's 400 watts of solar going through an 1800 watt inverter. You can have up to two batteries right on the front, which gives you, you could run a coffee pot without plugging in. So with that high amperage of an inverter, it works through the 110 uh, outlets. We train you how that works because it's a lot different than a lot of campers. They come with solar chargers, but not inversion and conversion systems for the electric. So going over the monitor panel area here, this actually has an eye on it. So when you walk by, it'll turn on and you just simply press buttons. If you notice some of the buttons down here, these have the blankets on the tanks. So these tanks are heated electronically with bags, as well as forced air heat with an enclosed underbelly. So these units could go way further into the winter time per se, and way early in the spring. So it's just not forced air. It's got the heat blankets on the tanks, as well as the forced air. As we look up here, we have the television, which rotates out and in, as well as we have a nice two 110 plugs with a USB charge point, and that just basically carries itself down in the kitchen area. This right here is a nice feature, the TST tire monitoring system, standard on all Flagstaff products. This allows you to monitor your tire temperature, and incidentally, the tires on all Flagstaffs are the Goodyear Endurance, which is the top rated tire for a camper. As we come around the kitchen area, we've got a large stainless steel sink, with dual dryers, single handle lever faucet, a very well done owner's manual. So instead of getting everything thrown in a packet, these actually are done at the plant. They separate everything for you here. They have all your information already in a book and you can add to your book and has everything you need to do. Your QR code scans and your access with a forest river it's a very nice, complete owner's manual book, just like the old days. Solid surface countertops. 22-inch oven is always standard in these units. It's got a three-cooktop cook burner located here. Tempered glass mount. The fan on this actually uh, goes outside, so it's not a recirculating fan. It takes everything from inside to outside. And you have your 1.3 Magic Chef uh, microwave, which is 0.3 larger than average. Moving to the refrigerator, this is a 12 volt multi airflow, 10.7 uh, cubic refrigerator. So that's a lot larger than a lot that's out there. We have the large air conditioner, which has dual venting front to back. So instead of a single track of vents, if you look up in the air, turn around uh, right above you, right, right there. So you have your dual vents all the way front to back. That gives you dual uh, airflow in this camper, and it's a fantastic thing, and it evenly gets the, distributes the cool air. In the slide-out area, we have a King uh, U dinette. This also folds down into a bed. So we have our forward queen. We have a King U dinette and two double downs in the back. So we, do com we can put a lot of people in this. It weighs 5,500 pounds. Uh, it's 26 foot 11 from stem to stern. That includes the front hitch. So a very nice compact unit with a lot of pluses and features to it. Lastly, we'll go into the restroom area. We have wall switches for lights instead of having to reach up like a lot of the campers. Large sink basin and sink area. Storage top and bottom. You have your China toilet, which is standard. 
and then we have a large step-in shower here. And note the height, I'm six foot one. I got another five, six inches here, so very usable. Plus we put the Max Air Vent fan, that's the third horsepower 10 blade fan in the bathroom. So come on out and see us at Best Choice Trailers and RV. Thank you.